Yo, 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 what up, guys? So Flux here, and today I have a gameplay with the one and only ADC Decker. Round of applause because she's amazing. Every time I get paired up with her, they're at least on my team 10 and 0. You just need crit on her, and that's it. Game over. So hopefully, you guys enjoy this. Drop a damn like if you guys do. If you guys don't, break everything off my setup. All right? <clears throat> and record it. I'll record it. Don't worry. I'm messing around, so besides that, let's get right into it. If you guys are off landing, you guys need a healer's token. This reduces 2.8 HP per second. You have a mana potion, reduces mana, and reduces health. So you have that. Archmagus, if you guys are wondering, my prime card. And then to the happy stone gems. You have all minor strikes, all minor strikes, impact hammer, two minor strikes, and a minor wound. Impact hammer once again. Major cast, two major wounds. Impact hammer for the 30th time. Two major casts and a wound. And then micro nuke actually had another impact hammer, replaced it with a micro nuke so I could hit over 900 DPS, which has two strikes and major cast. Wind carver blade, which has two minor casts and a strike. Wind carver blade, which has a strike, a kinetic, major kinetic, and lastly, hunger maul. With all lesser drains. Listen, guys, this build does work. Insane damage. Let's get right into the gameplay. Play it. Boys and girls, guess what? I have some amazing news for you guys. I didn't lose. That's number one. Number two, if you guys don't know, bro, that guy Cameron, Cam, something, I don't know his name, but I'm about to show up a picture right about now. He just seems like the man. Think about it. In every Paragon community, he's like Spotlight or like not just Spotlight itself. Just the videos they uh, showcase on the Paragon YouTube channel. You know, I'm always watching those. Really cool. He talks about the new hero. Talk about major updates or this and that. He said there's an update coming out May 16th. And I forgot the name of that update. But it had a name behind it. It had a, like a legit name. And pretty much... Really, really cool just knowing that there is going to be a major update. There's going to be a Kalari buff. They said there's going to be an Iggy rework, which is amazing. But think about it. Kalari is going to be buffed. They said when he hits the Shadow Plane, apparently he's gaining HP while in that Shadow Plane. When he's about to die, he goes instantly into Shadow Plane and stuff like that. Like This is really, really good, especially for Kalari players because they could do a lot of damage and be very stealthy at the same time. So that's really, really cool. And if you guys don't ever watch them, go ahead, watch them. Legit, if it's an hour long, I watch all of them just to know what we're going through. You know, how the community is doing, I guess. Just how Paragon's doing in general. Stuff like that. So keep that in mind, guys. Like, really go watch those videos and don't get turned on by my boy Cam. All right? Just have to throw that out there. Don't worry. One day, I have to meet this guy. He just seems like legit the man of the century. So besides that, let me just show you guys how to juke out Grux. You hold your Q. The second he's about to pull you in, you jump over the minions. He missed all his abilities. He got juked out at a point where he got stunned. He traumatized himself. Was like, damn, I can't believe that just happened. He went like completely AFK for a good two seconds. No RIP to him. That's legit of a definition of getting juked out. You know, I feel bad, super bad. And like super bad the movie and stuff like that. So if you guys don't know, legit was hitting 900 this game. This game at the moment was hitting 900, not specifically this game, but what I did was the build in the beginning, I changed, I ended up reducing like 4% crit and I gave myself 14 more damage or 12 damage. So I'm over that 900 mark. That's exactly what I wanted. I'm at 900 DPS. So just think about that. It's just amazing hitting that hard. Yin legit, I think is one of the best. I don't care what anybody says. Legit, she's great. Twin Blast is great too, but the thing is, like, she's hitting quick at a point where I don't know why Twin Blast doesn't compete, but I think he should. That's very, very bad though. It seems like he has two guns. He should be hitting faster, but apparently not. She's just hitting on another level, literally hard, and she's just hitting very quick. Like, nobody has a chance. Revenant has no chance. I'm just destroying his life. Really, really helpful, especially in team fights. Like, I could just cleave through everybody. This guy made sure he ulted and ran away. He was like, I'm not dealing with this Yin. This Yin's just on a different level. Every single time I went against him, he had no chance. Like, literally, I would think that he would be ahead of everyone or destroying in a 1v1 fight. But when this guy 1v1 me, it was like, damn, he probably 1v1 me with his ult on accident. Because this guy knows he's about to get tossed really quick. This Grux, very bad play on his part on the other team. He ended up retreating. This Revenant was 1v1ing me. You know, RIP to him. Instantly was going to die no matter what. He had no chance. Like, 
why would you even run away? You would have probably saved that Revenant. We ended up going for those Grux. We destroyed his life, but he ended up getting away. Super damn lucky too, because I thought I jumped on him, but apparently I jumped on the minions, and then this Howitzer didn't give a dump. He went in and act like he was better than everybody, and I don't know what now messing around. He legit jumped in, destroyed that damn Grux. RIP to him. Legit, you know, hopefully he sends me something I could run his tombstone soon. Stuff like that. But besides it, we invaded their jungle. We ended up taking every single buff. Just thinking about it, guys, like legit, I was killing Revenant inside his own base. Just think about that. So where he upgrades the cards, obviously, I'm literally destroying him while he's in there. He had no chance like just thinking the odds of that you know <laughs> they should have just forfeited right there I would have called it a day and be like yeah I'm done with Paragon for the next two months hopefully uh, I could recover from that so besides that honestly went in super hungry this game I was like listen all right I haven't ate this whole damn month I'm going ham this game this is gonna fill me up and that's exactly what I was aiming for legit this game i was just doing work not even me i always say me no literally it's my team too always doing good plays you know we're not messing up lately tell you guys straight up was on like a losing streak of like an 11 losing streak and just recovered from that literally had to take therapy from that and hopefully physical therapy next week so besides that though recovered from it and i'm doing great again just the one and only the greatest decker adc but you know besides that though let's just be real and i recovered from it in the last like six games seven games eight games i was playing good and we ended up winning went on that streak and it felt very very good pay attention though i'm hitting 627 672 uh opposite day guys i'm at uh 672 you know nobody heard that but just really hitting hard really notice when i did get or prime i was like it's game over i'm hitting 900 easily nobody could challenge me my support just doing circles around me nothing major though you know he was just checking me out if i was okay head to toe but you know from there on just destroyed when we got or prime notice that they were all gathering around or prime knew something was going on followed it really hoped that none of them died that's what i was aiming for so ended up just hitting these so at least by the time I got there, we could just go forward prime. Ready, three people got cleared. That's why I went for the damn minions. Nothing major though. We ended up slow pushing mid. Ended up going forward prime. And this is what really changed the game. Guys, at this moment though, I'm just hitting on another level. Nobody could compete. That was super delayed. I don't know if you guys noticed. This guy did the ability. The orb prime did his ability. And then 10 seconds later, I got tossed. Like I don't know what was going on there, but... You know, I was really, really gaining HP. I was on another level, guys. Destroying people. We attacked mid. Was noticing how hard I was hitting. It felt very, very good. Think about it. Three unspent power. Just really wanted to know exactly how much I hit. I hit 894. And just like what I said, want to hit that 900 mark. So what I did was, after this match, reduce like... 4% crit and exchange it for a power card so that's what really helped me because I figured my last unspent power was a crit chance card so it wasn't gonna really make a difference one hit green buff I was like holy dumb this is on a different level I could tower dive destroy anybody this game is just on another tear right now so pay attention destroy 745 this revenant saved his friend completely saved him because he altered me so my partner ended up just running away nobody could see me except their side so obviously they could have just ganked me and killed me but they didn't and your boy's not done shh everybody shh, go to sleep relax everybody just settle down because you know 900 is not enough for me i'm about to kill someone inside their base want to destroy all these people like every single one of these minions just to gain hp and then from there on you could just push because Every single person is right lane, ready destroying the inhib, and my minions are pushing mid. So it gives us time to push this tower, and it felt very, very good around this time. Instantly, Grux had no chance. Let's just be real at this point. Let's just be real. Got destroyed. It's going on a tear right now. I don't know what's going on. I can just cleave through everybody, destroy them. This girl's getting hit 730. Revenant, my boy. Hey, send me a postcard really quick, because I'm about to jump in, show you these hands. Nothing major, though. He so from there on, that pretty much wraps it up. Hopefully you guys do enjoy this video. Drop a damn like if you guys do. And I'm out. Peace. This build, OP Central. Shouldn't even be legal, to be honest.